Guys, so this is just a video, a short video for me to remind myself and you guys out there who doesn't know uh, What I have here is the iPhone 11 Pro and the camera of this phone apparently is able to shoot in two different formats which is the most compatible format or the high efficiency format most devices out there today does have that two options to shoot in if you're like me i edit my videos as well and if you plan on editing it later on don't ever use the high efficiency format the high efficiency format basically a different codec it saves storage it compresses your video differently and it saves storage so that you can store more videos or more files within the same amount of storage but then because of the different codec that they use it seems to be causing much problem in post-processing like myself I'm a premium pro user and I've been trying to edit a video of Belitong, Indonesia which is uh, an island which I went through last month and I'm currently having troubles here let me show you uh, let me show you how it looks Okay, so this is the clip. Now, if I play it back, it's gonna look, it's gonna skip. Okay, see that? It's skipping, it's skipping. I'm skipping again there. Okay, you see, I'm gonna show you again just a bit more. Okay, and I just, I see that? That's skipping. More and more and more. It should have not been like that. It's a different shot, but it kept on, it kept on skipping. So, uh, that's the problem. And I tried rendering it out. It seems to be, sometimes it's there, sometimes it's not. So I can't really count on it not being there because you know when you're editing, you need to be sure of the composition of that edit that you're making. And I tried converting it, but converting it, converting the clips is usually not a good idea because most of the time, it's gonna compress and it's gonna degrade your video quality a bit or it's gonna diagnose what could happen in there so it's best to just edit directly the video or footage you get from the devices so that's it guys uh hvc format stay away from it if you plan on post processing it on a different machine 